Hello all, Dan from DroneBlog.com here. In today's video, we'll go over step-by-step -step charging the DJI Mini 4 Pro drone batteries individually and collectively within the charging hub, as well as charging both types of DJI remote controllers, the RC2 and the RCN2. Feel free to use the chapters to skip to the areas of the walkthrough that pertain to you. After purchasing the Mini 4 Pro or any new drone, it's important to charge all batteries before using them, whether these be drone or remote controller batteries. Following the trend of the Mini 3 and Mini 3 Pro before it, the Mini 4 Pro does not include a power adapter. Now for the quickest charging speeds, DJI recommends their 30 watt DJI charger. While using the DJI branded 30 watt charger is recommended, most 30 watt aftermarket chargers will work just fine. Now the first step when charging the DJI RC2 or the RCN2, using the included DJI USB-C cable, attach the cable to a USB-C charger and plug the charger into your power source. Now again, the USB-C charger doesn't have to be a DJI 30 watt charger. Any 30 watt charger will be a fast charging device for the drone batteries and controller. Now, plug the USB-C cable into either the DJI RC2 or RCN2 controller. The lights on the controller will blink, showing that they're charging. After charging is completed, remove the USB-C cable from the remote controller. Now, if you'd like to check the amount of power the remote controller has at any given time, Simply press the power button once, and the LEDs will alert you to the remaining battery level. Now we'll talk about charging a single battery with the Mini 4 Pro. Now only one battery will be included if you purchase the Mini 4 Pro and controller only combo. To charge the single battery that came with the Mini 4 Pro, it must be done so within the Mini 4 Pro. Now as with the RC, Attach the included DJI USB-C cable to a USB-C charger and plug the charger into your outlet or power strip. Next, insert your Mini 4 Pro drone battery into the Mini 4 Pro. Plug the USB-C cable into the Mini 4 Pro. The lights on the drone will blink, showing that it's charging. After the Mini 4 Pro is completed fully charging, unplug it from the USB-C cable. Now, when charging the batteries while inserted in the Mini 4 Pro, it will take about 64 minutes to fully charge each standard battery and 101 minutes to charge the Plus version batteries. Now, you might notice that there's no way to check how much battery percentage is left on the battery when it's not plugged into the Mini 4 Pro. If you only have one battery and not the charging hub, you'll either have to press the power button once on the Mini 4 Pro while the battery is inserted, or alternatively, when you're in camera view on your remote controller in the DJI Fly app, check the upper right hand side of the screen for the Mini 4 Pro's current battery percentage. We'll now talk about charging via the two-way charging hub. A two-way charging hub in the Mini 4 Pro Fly More combo allows you to charge up to three intelligent flight batteries, whether these be standard or plus versions, along with your RC2 or RCN2 controller. The charging is done sequentially, meaning the drone battery with the highest battery level will get charged first, followed by the remote controller. To charge three batteries in a remote controller, insert your Mini 4 Pro batteries into the charging hub. You should have two DJI USB-C cables, the one that came with the Mini 4 Pro and the other that came with the Flymore combo. Plug one of the USB-C cables into your USB-C charger. Plug the other end into your charging hub. After this, plug your charger into an outlet. Next, take the second USB-C cable and plug the USB-C cable, this time the USB-N, into the charging hub. Now, take the second cable and then plug that into your remote controller. Your Mini 4 Pro batteries and the remote controller will all charge sequentially until all batteries have been fully charged. 
to quickly check how much battery life is left on the batteries in the charging hub, simply press the button on the side of the charging hub. All the LEDs under the batteries connected to the hub will light up with the respective battery percentage. Well, that's all for this video. If you have specific questions about this or our other videos, we'd love for you to join us at DronePilots.com. For more tutorials and reviews, head to DroneBlog.com.